Hey, good morning, fish heads. It is Monday morning, and we've got a few pieces to show off before we ship them out the door. And there's a couple of things that are different. I know you guys have seen a few of these pieces throughout the week, but as I get order requests in, that's pretty much the majority of what I'm filling uh, are just order requests from other patterns. This one's going out today, though. This is the Night King. It's in a Lucky Craft Popper. It's not a knockoff. I know you guys have seen the patterning before on this Night King, but I love showing it off. It's one of my favorite patterns, and you guys have made it one of my, my favorite patterns as well. You guys seem to really like this stuff. So, hey, you guys keep requesting it. I will keep building it for you for sure. A little bit different of a twist on this uh, wildfire. And we have got these glowing green and red eyes in here. It's a pair that's going to be going out for a customer in just a couple of days. Still have a couple of pieces to fill for them. But uh, these two, for sure, are going to be going together, as are these Rayburn Fade Craws. Good rattle, good weight, good depth. Great pattern for fall, winter, pre-spawn. Hits in the summer. I mean, really, it's a four-season pattern. It's definitely a three-season pattern. Did a, a bonus video that's going to be edited. I have yet to edit it, as a matter of fact. That's got to get edited today. That's where it's sitting, all the information. Um, all the videos right there. But this is a marbling pattern. A little bit darker for that fall winter look on those gills. It's got jets and lure eyes, my favorite. And this is on a Rapala. Again, not a knockoff. We're doing a lot of customer requests. There's your Rapala. It's a big bodied wake bait. It'll dive to about a foot, maybe a little bit deeper, but it just throws a huge wake off of it because of that downturned lip. And that's what you want. You want this thing to make a lot of noise, a lot of disturbance, and it will get bit. Wake baits are great in the fall too. If you guys are not throwing wake baits in the, in the fall, you need to be thinking about that option because they do very, very well. And yes, this is a little bit darker because we're going into that fall season, that winter, where they're gonna be a little bit deeper. That thermocline is gonna play a factor in your fishing here in the next couple of months, wherever you live in the United States. Another one of these Rayburn fades. I tell you what, look at that clear coat, folks. I mean, that's just, that's gorgeous. That's what KBS is all about. Really, really good. This is a blue ice crackle crawl. We're 2.5. Good one knocker, got a couple of BBs, and it does have a weight transfer in it, which is awesome. Something that's really helpful on your cast, and it also gives a really good erratic motion in the water. Got those glow eyes. This is, this is a fun bait to paint, and it's even more fun throwing it on the water. Small mouth, large mouth, walleye, pike, toothy critters, they all hit this. All of them. A little bit of pink on the throat. It's got that fluorescence about it. And also in a wake bait. This one's going to be heading out to a customer today. Just needs to get cleaned up, dressed up, geared up, and out the door. Super patterns. I think he'll do very well with this pattern. One of my faves as well. And a couple of rattle traps. This is the Molten Lava Hand Painted Eyes. Now this is going to be going out to, this is a father-son winning combination from, uh, I believe it's the Northeast Main Bass Club. So there were four placing winners. 
and uh, we're happy to take care of all four of them. We gave them gift certificates and uh, we love to see youth anglers out there. And luckily as a small business owner, I'm not really bound to obligations that larger companies can be. So I kind of get to pick and choose and uh, anything that involves youth or um, special needs, I'm all over that. I love to provide recreation outlets for youth, special needs, Down syndrome, autism. It's, uh, it's one, of my, one of my favorite causes to contribute to. So hit me up. I can only do a few a year because I am a small business, but I will certainly give you a legitimate consideration here at Jekyll Bates. You bet we will. So just uh, hit me up in a message, either Jen Cravassi at JekyllBates.com, or you can find me Facebook Messenger, Instagram, oh gosh, Twitter. I'm everywhere. So all those links are posted below on how to get a hold of me. This is cool. So these are rattle traps. Um, not to get too far in the weeds, but these are not knockoffs. These are original Bill Lewis rattle traps and just fun, fun, fun patterns to paint on. I think this one's going to be auctioned later on today. But hey, that's what I've got for you this morning. That is your Monday edition update. We got a few pieces going out. We've got uh, a molten lava in an S crank style. We've got a brook trout going out. More of these Rayburn Craws. I tell you, they are popular this time of year because, especially down here in the southern states, uh, red is just a color that gets everybody fired up. And then this was auctioned over the weekend. This was the Saturday spray session. And that's that sexy, big sexy citrus, we'll call it, in a shad pattern. So thanks for hanging out. Thanks for watching. I will catch you uh, on the next one. See you guys on the water. And uh, look for this little gem right here to be uploaded. That is going to be how to do marbling patterns. And we did it on that uh, wake bait right here on this Rapala big-bodied wake bait. You guys have a great day. Enjoy your week. Happy casting.